I take it back, he's not using draw head swing. The lifting loads on the side of the locomotive. You can see it from here. If I can zoom in. Those men are actually up under the trucks, hooking up the brake rigging. told one traction motor cost about $75,000. They're replacing two on that. Some on this other locomotive. Plus the expense of the cranes and the contractor to do the work. Pretty expensive operation here. Well, the evening sun has come out. It's shining in up under the clouds right now, but in another hour it'll be dark here. They're still trying to rig the trucks up on this thing. Hope they go ahead and pick it up pretty soon where I can get a good shot of it. Well, I've waited a good two or, two or three hours while they work on the brakes on this truck, but it looks like they might be getting ready to pick it up now. Maybe I haven't waited in vain. Afraid it was going to get too dark. He's giving him a signal to come up with it. Sixty-one seventy-seven is coming up in the air. Now they got to take the blocks out from under it. They've got a snatch block arrangement on a winch cable to pull the trucks up under the engine when they get it up in the air. Working on their winch cable to get it ready to pull up under there. So we've got a lot of slack in that winch cable. They got a chain tied around the rail, I guess it is. Well, they took it back off now. Just digging out under the other rail.
think he's finally got his winch cable tight. I think we're going to work now. Sixty-one seventy-seven is finally coming up in there. 